Y'all, tired of needing to use a beach recover with sandbag? Even if you aren't, I am sick of seeing your crusty dust bags blow yourselves up. And with the announcement of the sandbag reskin, I have seen too many of y'all trying to gain aura with his upbeat. You're not Lucario. I promise. Instead of complaining, I have decided to take you guys under my wing and showcase the neat quirks that Sandbag has. They're not clearly laid out at all, and it's left to the players to find out these tricks for themselves. If there are some basic tricks that I didn't touch upon, be sure to let me know in the comments. For starters, Sandbag's dash sucks. It's slow and he literally stops. Do I need to say any more? There are two basic ways to bypass this. I call them Hesitant Dash and Mash Dash. Hesitant dashing basically has Sandbag Fox trotting across the stage. You know you've done it optimally when you don't hear Sandbag's initial dash. I never use this because it's not very easy and it's a little tricky on the fingers. Mash Dash fixes both of those problems. While dashing, just mash Crouch. Your Crouch canceling Sandbag's dash into another dash. Be careful mashing dash and end lag because you may stutter for a few frames before successfully mash dashing, as there is a specific timing to it, but it's pretty lenient. Although Sandback has a crappy dash, he does excel on the ground, more on that later. Luckily, aerial downbeat, sand dash, exists. Sandback can use downbeat in three different directions, forwards, backwards, and upwards. The horizontal directions throw Sandback downwards in the respective directions, and he gets so much mileage for it. Mix it up with an aerial, air dodge, or just use it to swiftly get back on stage. I primarily sand dash upwards to recover. Sandbag can usually make it back to the stage with that and a well-timed jump. Sometimes side B may need to be used to get back as well. See? No bombs. If you must use bombs, dip down low, B reverse the up B, and hold in. Magic. Also, please tech. If you can't tech, then you're just not going to be able to live with Sandbag, there's no way around it. If Sandbag is on a platform, then he will be able to dash attack or down tilt off the platform with an added boost. The distance of the boost depends on the move and how far away Sandbag was from the edge. Although down tilt's boost distance is small, both moves still have their hitboxes out, and dash attack is powerful. The last basic trick I'll go over is Sandbag's pseudo wave dash. Performing a horizontal sand bash while holding down will cause sandbag to slide. He has access to all of his moves while he's sliding. Shield, forest smash, grab, and even aerials all get boost from his pseudo wave dash. Sandbag already has a great grab game and a great combo game. When we add in a wave dash, this character is just so awesome, especially on the ground. So there y'all have it. Sandbag is not no pyromaniac, nor is he just immobile either. He got some sauce, okay? He do got some sauce. Thanks for watching.